Hi everyone, so getting on to Violet's Christmas presents for this year. Like I said with Alice's video, I'll link her previous Christmas hauls um, below so you can have a look if you're looking for like a three-year-old or a two-year-old or even a one-year-old, I'm sure I've done one of those as well. Um, so, difference between Alistair and Violet. Violet's still at home, so she plays with her toys a lot. Um, I don't know, being a girl, she's very much into like babies and dollies, dressing up. Um, very creative, she's very like into role playing, like hands on with like cooking and cleaning and kitchens and she's just very like mummified and just loves that sort of way of playing I suppose. So I've got kind of gone down that route. Her toys are slightly like seeing them wrapped up um, compared to Alice's. Her stuff looks a lot more bulkier and bigger and it will take up more space but this is basically what she's into. Um, so yeah, I'm going to get started with her main present, which is what she's wanted and keeps asking for is a double push chair. Um, she actually did ask for a baby to go in it, or two babies, but I was like, well, I obviously haven't spoke to her about it, but um, she has tons of babies and she's got about six or seven. I don't think she needs any more, but obviously she hasn't got a double push chair or tandem or anything. So this is one thing that I wanted it to be her main present. So the one I got, this is the one that I found and well she actually saw it in the Smiths catalogue and kind of circled it and was one that she wanted. This one is called Ella Tandem Dimples. It was actually on offer £10 off so it was £39.99 and as you can see it's a tandem push chair. Um, it's in purple, it has really good reviews, um, oh it's really heavy so Graham's going to have to set that up for Christmas. Um, yeah, so that's basically her main present. It has really big wheels as well, which looks good. It has a big basket at the bottom. It's very, like, girly, and, yeah, it just, it looked sturdy and exactly what she really wanted. So, this is pretty much her main present. Some items that I got in the Sainsbury's Half Price Sale, I picked up this Galt, um, Sensational Sequins. This is like a sort of sequin. You've put the sequins in the right places. She loves this sort of thing. She can sit for hours doing creative stuff like this. So I got her that. I have a feeling this might have been about three or four pounds. So I got her that. Also from the Sainsbury's half price sale. She doesn't have anything frozen. And like when we go to like places like Toys R Us, she's always like, oh, I really want a doll. Like, you know, like an Anna or an Elsa doll. So uh, I saw this one for half price. I think she might have been 11 pounds maybe. Um, so I got her that, she's a little Elsa doll with a little Olaf and a hairbrush and you can like brush her hair and stuff so um, yeah I thought that was quite cute and it's a good size as well. So yeah, got her that and also in the Sainsbury sale I got her a little hoover. She really wants a hoover, she really wants actually like the mini version of the Hetty. I got the pink like Hetty. Um, she wanted that one, but I mean this one was like half price, it was about £7.50 I think. So um, yeah, I got her that and I think she's going to love um, helping me hoover the house with that. Um, so yeah, that's what I got from Sainsbury's. A couple of books I've got her. This one um, is the next book which we haven't had before which is called Blown Away by Rob Biddeff. We have obviously the Gura book. Um, and I really wanted to get this one on Amazon. It was like three pounds something when it like brand new, and it has really lovely um, illustrations. And I thought this would be good for both children. I don't know why the screen is really really bright. There we go. Um, yeah, so I think they'd both like that one. Also, the Father Christmas needs a wee. I actually got these recently from Asda. They were two for seven pounds. Um, again, Alistair will love this one, so I thought I'd get this one for her. And then the snowman, obviously. This is just a classic that we don't have and we love watching it on telly um, around this time of year. So I got that one and this one actually comes with a CD as well, which is really, really good. Um, so that's the books I got her. Extra little girly bits that I got her. So in the Tesco clearance last year, I got a few things for like other people and stuff. Um, but these are two items that I got. Um, I got these little shoes and earrings like dressing up set. I think this might have been like three pounds or something like that, but it's actually quite a nice little girly set with a little tiara and clip on earrings, you know. Um, I also got this Play-Doh Doc McStuffins 
um, little set. She loves Play-Doh, so I think this was about three or four pounds as well. Um, I got this from Home Bargains for like months ago, like six to eight months ago. This was only like 5 99 it was really, really cheap, and I remember having one of these as a child. It's like a doodle bear. You can draw all over it and then put it in the washing machine with these special markers. Um, so I thought that would be really nice. I think she'd like that. It's quite a cute bear as well. This is a random item that I got from Matalan when I did an order. Um, I don't know if you can see it, actually. Yeah, it's just a lovely, gorgeous unicorn money box. It was £6, and I just thought it was super super cute and then the last three items I got from Amazon I saw them on offer and I just thought she would love them I got them ages ago so this item I wish I would have got her a dressing up dress I may may if I can find one at a really cheap or reasonable price I will get her a nurse's outfit as well but I got her a little doctor's um, little kit I suppose medical bag medical kit I think this was seven pounds from Amazon so I think she'd like that. Of course, I got her another set of Duplo, Sophia the Princess. This was about £15, I think, or maybe a bit less, I can't remember. But yeah, I thought she would love that. She loves her Duplo. And the last item I got, which was from Amazon, I saw this. It was in the it's like reduced section, or like it was reduced at a certain point, um, for like, I think it was under £10. It's the Elsa Styling Head. I actually got a similar one for my niece, which Violet really, really liked, so I thought this would be good for her as well. She's very much into hair and she like brushes her doll's hair and puts clips in them and stuff, you know? Um, so that is pretty much all of Violet's Christmas presents. Again, I will try and link everything below. I hope you've enjoyed this video. I hope it's given you some inspiration and I will see you all soon.